हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल आई एम बैक विद अनदर वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग प्रॉब्लम दिस प्रॉब्लम यू वुड हैव सीन बिफोर बट देयर इज अ चेंज इन दिस प्रॉब्लम राइट देयर इज अ लिटिल ट्विस्ट इन द प्रॉब्लम एंड वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व दिस विद थ्री सॉल्यूशंस सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट्स सो दिस प्रॉब्लम वाज आस्क्ड इन द आईटीसी इंफोटेक इंटरव्यू एंड वी हैव अ टेबल a uh, city distance table you can say where we have source destination and distance between the cities okay let me take you the sql server and show you the data so this is how it is this is my input table and this is the expected output now there are two twist in this problem so what we have to do essentially is we have to find the duplicates and retain only the unique values but duplicates are not straight forward so in this we have the distance between two cities from new delhi to panipat distance is 100 which is fine now if you look at this example bangalore to mysore the distance is 150 but we have another record mysore to bangalore and distance is 150 again so this is a kind of duplicate if you see right when there is a duplicate we want only the first record in the output okay okay remember this we want the first record so if in your input table bangalore mysore is first in the output also i want bangalore mysore first i mean i want bangalore mysore only in the output i don't want mysore bangalore how however it doesn't make much sense but still the question says the first record you have to retain right now there is another twist is there can be two cities where the distance might not be same so for example tirupati to tirumala it is 60 and tirumala to tirupati is 80 so we have to retain both of the records right so this is the first thing and in case of duplicates again for example chennai bhopal bhopal chennai distance is also same so we want to retain the first record chennai bhopal so in the output we have chennai bhopal okay so i'll solve with this three methods but in the first two methods in the first two solution i will not guarantee that first row will come in the in output okay it is not so important because it doesn't matter if if i show bangalore to mysore mysore to bangalore but we will solve this in the third solution we will make sure that the first row from the input is in the output okay so let's start with the first solution now when this kind of problems come the first thing comes is self join why so let me explain you quickly in the excel so let me go to the excel so in excel i have this table right what i can do i can create one more instance of this table as it is just imagine there are two tables right there are two tables with the same structure and i will call it c1 city distance and this is c2 now when i join these two tables right based on what that source should be equal to the destination of this table and the destination of this table right uh, let me take green to source right so now when i do this what is going to happen so new delhi right will be joined with this row so if you see let me take another color let's say this color so new delhi and here new delhi because source is getting joined with destination this will join but panipat will not join with ambala right so these two records will not join right this record this and this will not join why source is equal to destination which is fine but my second condition is destination should also equal to source so this will not join let's look at another record so there is no there is no duplicate for this because there is no new delhi anywhere else look at this right look at this so if you look at bangalore right bangalore will join here right bangalore will join here this record and mysore is also join right so these rows will join correct because source is equal to destination and destination is equal to source right so these two rows rows will join again if you see mysore bangalore again this will join right this is kind of duplicates but again this row will join with the other row so mysore will join with this one and bangalore will join with this one so we will get two records and both the records will be joined for mysore bangalore right let me do this do this in sql server and show you the output so i'll say from city distance let's call it c1 as i said right let me take it little down and i will do left join i'll tell you why i am doing left join left join city distance c2 on 
c1 dot source equal to c2 dot destination right that's what we did here right c1 dot source equal to c2 dot destination and i will put two conditions right c1 dot destination equal to c2 dot source <coughs> okay so now what we'll do i'll take all the columns from c1 comma all the columns from c2 so first c1 columns will be there in the output so if you see for these two rows they are not duplicates right there is no record of panipat new delhi in my in my table right this is my table and i'm doing left join so all the records are coming from left table so there are no duplicates at all for these two rows and that is why nothing is coming from the right table there is no swept record where panipat and new delhi is there so there is no join and it is coming as null right for so bangalore mysore mysore bangalore we are getting the join similarly mumbai pune pune mumbai we are getting the join similarly for tirupati tirumala as well we are getting the join right so we are getting everything here now what we will do what we need i will start solving the problem first of all wherever this distance is null right that record we need so i will say where c2 dot distance or any column is null right so this will give me the first two records so if i run this the, this is giving me the first two records and this is what i want right now let's look at the other records now if you look at this records where the distance is not same between two cities here the distance from c1 and c2 are different so i can say all c1 dot distance equal to c2 dot distance <coughs> okay so this record will also come and this record will also come because distances are not same here it is 60 80 and 60 80 so both both the records will come and that is what we wanted also so if i just run this i am getting uh, not equal to sorry my bad not equal to so we are getting the first two rows where it is null and the two rows where distances are not same right now for rest of the rows let me run it without where clause again for rest of the rows these rows i want one one record only i don't want both the records right for that what i can do i can make use of sky value so the sky value of b is less than m right so if i say all source is less than destination right if i do this sorry c1 dot source is less than c1 dot destination if i do this what will happen out of these two only one record will come right out of these two only one record will come why because there will be a one record where sky value is less than source is less than destination and for other record it will be greater because values are same here it is Ma bangalore mysore here it is mysore bangalore so for one of the record definitely the sky values has to be less and for other it has to be greater so i will say source is less than destination so b's sky value is less than my source so this record will come and this will not come similarly in mumbai pune m come first so this record will come this will not come right in this chennai bhopal b comes first so this record will come and this will not come so in this answer we are not guaranteeing that all, always the first record will come in the output but we will get the required output so we got the seven rows and for these three rows we have the one one row only there are no duplicates and if i want only the three columns i can just say c1 star and this will give me the answer okay so this is your first solution we are using the self join using the left join okay let's move on to the second solution in second solution also we are going to use this sky value comparison concept but in a different way okay so select star from city distance okay so what i will do now what i will do i am going to create two more columns okay let me create it and show you how we can use it so i will say case when okay case when source is less than destination then source else destination 
and a source. I'll just tell you what I'm doing. It might be confusing, but don't worry. I'll explain you. Then destination L source. And instead of calling them source and destination, let's call city one city two. Okay. So let me run this now. Okay. So if you city, if you see, I have created two new columns and what I'm doing, I'm making sure that the city names are in a same order in both the records. So here also Bangalore, Mesu, Bangalore, Mesu. here also Mumbai, Pune, Mumbai, Pune, here also Bhopal, Chennai, Bhopal, Chennai. What I have done is I'm again checking the sky value. So let's, let's look at the city one column. Okay. So this is my city one column, right? Now I'm saying if source is less than destination is source less than destination. If you look at the first, this statement source is less than destination right so i'm taking source as city one right now for this record if you see is source less than destination no no then in that case i'm taking destination as city one so what happens the the city with lower sky value will always come in the city one in city two the record with higher sky value will come so I'm saying if source is less than destination, then I'm doing reverse, then give me destination L source, right? So you can try it yourself if it is confusing, but this will give you in a same order. Similarly, everything else. Now I can use these columns, right? To remove the duplicates. Now I cannot use these columns as output because here, if you see Tirumala Tirupati, Tirumala Tirupati, right? I don't want this. These two records will look same, right? So I cannot use city one, city two column as an output. Otherwise, I would have simply done this with city as and I can do just this select distinct city one comma city two comma distance from city. But in that case, it will remove duplicates because these are pure duplicates. Distance is also same. But if you see Tirumala Tirupati is together and this can also jumble based on the sky value. So this we cannot do, right? So what we have to do, we have to use these columns just to remove duplicates. But in the output, we have to use these columns only. Otherwise, it will mess things up. Okay. So what I will do, I'll just do this. I'll say select star and I will say count star over partition by partition by city one city two distance right distance also because if distance is also same they will group it up right as cnt okay so what i am doing i am saying city one city two and distance based on that do the partitioning and get me the count right so these two records will have two as the count so if i run this You see these records, wherever the duplicates are there, the count is two. Everywhere else it is one. The, the rows have jumbled. The second row is here because, because I am doing partition by, so it is doing some kind of sorting. But this is the record where there is no duplicate. This is the record also where there is no duplicate. And this is the record where the distance is different. So no duplicate because we are taking distance also in partition by. Okay. So I'll make it as CT2. Okay, and I will say select star from CT2, right? And where now I will say where's give me all the records where count equal to one. These records we want as it is, right? All of these four records should come. Or wherever count is not one, right? Again, give me where source is less than destination. Same thing, right? Again, give me those where source is less than destination. Source is less than destination. So in that case, I will get only one record out of these two. Again, I'm not making sure that only the first record will come. So here I will say, give me distance, source and destination. Sorry, comma. Okay. So if I run this now, this will give me the output. Okay. Again, 
absolutely fine okay so we have one record for bangalore mysore one record for bhopal chennai and one record for mumbai pune right everything else is as it is okay let's move on to the final one where we want to make sure that order is maintained so again start again select star from city distance let me do some enters and run this now to make sure that first record is first how i will identify that which is the first record so i have to create some kind of row number here right if i create a row number in the same order in whatever order data is there in my table in the same order if i maintain a row number then somehow i can solve it okay so i'll generate a row number which is in the same order because there is no other column id or date on which i can do orders by right so there is a trick for it i'll say row number over order by now for order by i will say select null this is how it works in sql server okay as rn if i do order by select null what it will do it will generate a row number in the same order of the table so if you see it has created 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 it is the same order which is present in your table okay so i have not used any order by your partition by just row number okay now here this i can use right whichever has minimum that one i will take so if i have to tie between these two and choose which one to take i will take 3 okay now what i will do i will just copy this solution right i'll just copy this solution and in this solution what i will say with sorry with ct as this i will create ct right so i have the row number in this ct okay and after that i'll just paste this solution the first solution and instead of ct distance i will use ct again here i will use ct okay so once you do this now only thing you have to make a change is instead of saying source is less than destination i will say rn is less than rn so i will say c1.rn is less than c2.rn now what will happen let me go to the excel and explain you so let's say i have the rn here right and it is 1 2 3 4 5 6 let's take this example mumbai pune okay so this mumbai pune and pune mumbai right so this will join with mumbai pune will join with which record so let me copy this here as well okay so when i join this mumbai pune right let me color again something blue and this pune mumbai will join right so pune mumbai will join right so these two records will join again again these two records pune mumbai and pune mumbai right mumbai pune this will join right when these two will join right the source column will be 4 the source rn will be 4 and from here it will be 5 right this will be 4 so that's call it rn1 right and this will be rn2 coming from c2 table right and this will be 5 and for this record it will be 4 and rn2 will be uh, sorry this will be 5 and this will be 4 so when i say this rn1 less than rn2 only this record will come right the record with lower rn will come so instead of source is less than distance i am saying c1.rn less than c2.rn in that way only the record with less rn will come in case of duplicate if you see we have maintained the order right we have maintained the order the bangalore mysore is there mumbai pune is there and then chennai bhopal is there in our other solutions bhopal chennai was coming not the chennai bhopal now we have made sure that first record is always coming so we have just created row number and after the self join we are saying rn is less than c1.rn is less than c2.rn okay you can try it yourself and if you have a better solution let me know thanks for watching hope it helps have a good day